welcome to the project demonstration of smart iot based hydrophonic system so here uh, we are fully demonstrating the project along with the plant growing uh, cups and continuously water pumping to this uh, chamber uh, which contains the water continuously flowing with the help of the motor and also we are using sensors of uh, water quality monitoring that is a turbidity temperature as well as a ph sensor and salinity conductivity turbidity total six parameters we can monitor on the lcd screen along with iot cloud platform that is a think speak so in the think speak we can see these are the fields ph so this is a ph sensor and the ph sensor uh, right it will be placed in the water and the next turbidity and this is a turbidity sensor and the next uh, temperature and the temperature sensor we are using right so this is the temperature sensor okay ph turbidity temperature sensor there's a ds 18 b temperature sensor we are using and the uh, next which is placed and uh, salinity so this is a salinity sensor we are using so salinity which is used to measure the salt content inside the water which is major uh, for plant growing it should be uh, more than normal okay and the uh, conductivity means more than normal more than the drinking water so is a conductivity so this is a conductivity sensor we are using this one for the sorry this is the salinity sensor which will measure the salt levels inside the water and this one is the conductivity sensor the two electrodes which has the conduct conductivity sensor which will measure the conduction between the two electrodes and this is a salinity sensor and the next water level sensor so this is the water level sensor okay a total six parameters continuously monitor and displayed on the lcd screen and also the data will be uploaded to the think speak with the help of this esp8266 wifi module so esp8266 wifi module so coming to the components wise so as we discuss ph turbidity temperature uh, conductivity and uh, salinity and uh, the so called data will be continuously is so a water level this is low wise so to this think speak with the help of this esp8266 wifi module so which was interfaced at the pin number 8 and 9 pin number 227 for the lcd screen a0 a1 a2 a3 and uh, pins are interfaced to the salinity conductivity turbidity sensors and the temperature sensor and uh, ninth pin uh, sorry uh, yeah and ph sensor and uh, ninth pin was interfaced to the which 8 and 9 for the esp8266 they are the interfacing connections uh, directly to the arduino uno board and this is the breadboard to distribute the 5 volts power supply throughout the input and output modules okay so the total platform we have mounted so before demonstration before demonstration we need to fill the water till this level remember that till this level uh, we need to fill the water and the uh, next on the hotspot in your mobile phone so go to hotspot settings and uh, change the hotspot name to which Yeah, configure the hotspot name to which right. I have a project six eight nine one is the hotspot name. All our small letters without any space, without any capital letter. Password should be one two three four five six seven eight nine. AP band should be two point four gigahertz. After configuring the hotspots on the hotspots along with data, now log into the ThinkSpeak. Okay, now on the power supply. Now on the power supply to this adapter. and next this is the power supply for the motor to pumping the water so let us wait till the sensor stabilized and you can see one device is connected in your mobile phone right one device is connected and data will be uploaded into think speak so before uh, we can get the live data also before erasing this data we can get this data can be downloaded so for that data import export first step before erasing the data download the data so open so we can see the date and time along with number of entries and field 1 field 2 field 3 as we have discussed field 1 is ph and uh, turbidity temperature like that so after we took the backup now go to channel settings in that only do clear channel only clear channel don't delete the channel only clear the channel once a channel got cleared successfully now we can go to the private view
there you can stay on the screen the old data got erased and we'll get the fresh live data now we can on the motor slowly the water will be pumping into this right and once filled the water will be come out into the same container right so we can see the sensors data is continuously uploading into this cloud platform Which, so as I hope now we are on the water continuously flowing. Right. And we can see the data also on the L C D screen. And the things speak. For every fifteen seconds of duration, the system keep on uploading the data to this. Right. Right. Okay. Thank you.